Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to transfer photos from your iPad to your iPad Pro. So it doesn't matter which iPad you have, let's get right into it. So first of all, on both iPads, I want you to swipe down from the top right to access the control center. And what you're going to do is you're going to see that little uh, icon here, tap in that one, and you'll see AirDrop. You want to set AirDrop to everyone on both iPads. So you can see, tap into the AirDrop icon, make sure it's set to everyone. Don't make sure don't make sure it's on the contacts only set it to everyone and then the next step is on the ipad itself you're going to open up the photos app you're going to see here select and you just want to select all the photos you want to transfer so here's the thing one by one this is going to take ages right so what you can do a little tip is you can tap and then slide so if you do it fast enough you can see you can select multiple at once and then if you drag your finger down you can see you can fast select and if you bring your finger near to the bottom of the uh uh, the page it will scroll down the page so if you want to select, uh, transfer all the photos you can just do that it may take a couple of minutes but it will select all the photos no hassle so let's just say i'm going to select five photos and then all you do is you tap on share airdrop and then you find your ipad so uh my ipad isn't showing up so we're going to do some troubleshooting i'm going to check the wi-fi here i'm going to make sure we're on the same wi-fi network so you can see I'm on the same Wi-Fi network. I'm also going to check no VPNs are connected. And I'm also on no proxy server on either device. So I'm going to go back to the photos and just give it a bit. I'm just going to make sure my name on my iPad isn't Alf's iPhone. No, it is Alf's iPad. So it's still not showing up. So what I'm going to do is if that's the case, I'm just going to turn on airplay mode, turn it back off. Remember, this is a feature inside of iOS. And there we go, else iPad is now showing up. So it's a bit glitchy, but it will work eventually. And all we do is we tap on the iPad. You're going to see AirDrop. Just tap on Accept. And it's going to transfer everything over. So you can see, there we go. It really, it's that easy. So once you've done that, you can just remove all of the photos, which are on the old iPad, if you would like to. And um, yeah, that's all there is to it. So thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.